When you're doing a past life regression or any kind of hypnotic journey where you are in touch with other energies or aspects, yes, even of your own soul, you are channeling. Now, some people I've come across in their state of channeling are so sensitive and open and connected that they bring through energies that we just don't anticipate, which really isn't news here since I've already talked about getting in touch with like alien energies and things like that. But I want to talk about when we got in touch, for example, with the energy of Mama Earth. And this is what came through. I'm going to read. You cannot exist if I do not exist. Many of you are feeling as if it is a time of peril. And in a sense, it is. I have been giving messages for many, many years through the sensitives, through the sensitives, the sensitive people. But you are not heeding any warning. I will come through stronger. And in case you're wondering, yes, there were full body chills when that message came through. And Mama Earth visited for a while. We have a lot of messages from her, as well as the source energy and other energies like knowledge. Knowledge as an energy came through. It's pretty fascinating, but I wanted to read that here because of what we're seeing around us happening. Now, this channel in particular, this message, it was channeled four years ago. And since then, we've seen a lot happen on planet Earth. And then you factor in the idea, or I should say the fact, that planet Earth itself is a consciousness. It's not just a rock. It's not just a dumb, empty rock. Planet Earth, like other planets, on an energetic spiritual level is an entity in itself, a living, breathing being. This is why all the trees are connected through their own spiritual energetic root network. This is why we got a message of, hey, if you're going to pluck a flower from a plant, leave something in return, even just a blessing. Just something to consider as you walk the earth. Because like another message said, every step you take on this earth is considered a holy step on a sacred site. So hopefully that's interesting and I'll be back with more. Bye.